Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning into my channel, Mini Movement Man, where music meets movement. Today we're talking about functional movement awareness. What is it? How can we apply it to our lives? So in this first clip here, you'll notice that I am bending over, my hips are high, I'm putting a lot of pressure in my lower back, and I stand up and, oh, there's the spasm. Oh, down I go. All right, in this next clip here, notice how I'm kneeling down on the ground and I'm really stabilizing my core. I begin to pick up the logs and if one is out of reach, I actually move my body closer, reposition the core, make sure I'm nice and tight, and then look at this. Now that I'm stable, nice and low to the ground, I can then begin to put all the wood on one side and of course when I go to the other side I'll switch arms right into a deep squat and then I stand up around to the stack and here we go putting it down is a different story you want a nice gentle controlled drop make sure the logs don't go flying everywhere for safety reasons and then begin to place your pieces in this same scenario, how much awareness would you have of your body? Would you realize that you are constantly bending over, keeping the hips high, putting a lot of stress on your body? Would you have the ability to even go down into the deep squat or a kneeling position? Now your functional fitness is the measure of how well you can do day-to-day -day activities. Functional movement awareness is, as you are moving along, are you aware of your body and are you being efficient and safe with your body? Or are you doing things that are putting you in risk of injuring yourself? Now, I'm really trying not to be silly about this. I don't expect everybody to put 20 pieces of wood onto one side and then carry it to a pile. That's really not being efficient. If you wanna have really good functional movement throughout your day, you need to make sure that you're proceeding with caution, you're being very calculated with your movements, and you are going nice and slow. Notice here that this is a more realistic version of how I would be moving around, but still, you can see that my body goes into multiple levels and planes, and with a lot of effort comes a little bit of reward. We got a nice stack for the end of the day. Remember, this is not a video about stacking wood. Functional movement applies to everyone that moves on this earth. Whether you are a singer of a top 40 cover band, a personal trainer, or a parent, we all need to use our bodies every day. The question is, how well can you use yours? Guys, we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for tuning in.